Hi everyone, my name's Fran and I am the writer at pauseforadvice.com and the content creator for the Pause for Advice YouTube channel. Um, in this video, we're going to be looking at what Maine Coons like to play with. And if you can hear any scrabbling about in the background, I'm sorry, our Maine Coons have got their hands on a piece of foil and that seems to be providing them with an awful lot of entertainment. So it's really important that you provide your Maine Coon with a selection of things to play with. And this is because Maine Coons are quite often kept as indoor pets. And there are a variety of reasons for this, which I won't get into right now. Um, I'll probably do an entirely different video about that. Um, but the reason that you want to make sure that your Maine Coon has lots of toys to play with is that you don't want them to get bored. If you're keeping your Maine Coon as an indoor pet, then you need to keep them well stimulated, um, especially if you're going out to work and leaving them for long periods during the day, um, especially if they don't have any other animals in the house that they can um, interact with. Um, they can very easily become quite unstimulated and also lonely as well so you need to keep them well entertained during the day particularly when you're not around another thing is if you're keeping your main coon as an indoor pet then there is a chance that they're going to get overweight because they're not going outside and chasing after all sorts of prey and things like that so you need to make sure that they've got lots of toys available to keep them well exercised within the house so i'm going to go through um what our main coons uh, like in the way of toys is quite a wide selection and then what I'll do is I'll also put links to um, I'll also put some links to things in the description as well um, I have written a whole article on this I'll put a link to the article so you can take a look at that if you like or I'll also just put links to the individual items if you just want to go straight to the page So here we have a teaser toy, um, which is just like a multicoloured snake on a stick. And I think we actually won this one um, in a fair somewhere, you know, when you, when you play those games and they give you a prize. Um, so it's a bit of a random prize, but the cats seem to enjoy it. And you can pick these up um, in lots of different places. So that's also closed. In each case, the head teachers uh, sending out letters to the parents, giving advice and explaining the situation. There are obvious risks, obviously, in a primary school like this. Lots of young children playing together in fairly close confinement here. Uh, but as we say, the risk apparently is still very low. But the schools remain closed now for two days. Thank you for that update, Sally. That's Sally Challoner, who's in court for show was live on the programme this morning. A hundred British negotiators are travelling to Brussels to begin talks about... very quickly end up under the sofa, as demonstrated. Now, when it comes to entertaining your main coons, you really don't need to spend a lot of money on buying all these expensive toys because they get so much pleasure out of some of the most basic household items, they really do. 
R2, for example, will go absolutely nuts over just a piece of foil. Um, funny story, actually, uh, we had a lot of foil covered sweets, like chocolates around Christmas time. And oh my God, they went absolutely nuts for them. Um, which was really funny at the time to just watch them go crazy over pieces of foil and chase them around the house. But then I just kept finding little pieces of foil just in random places all over my house for like weeks and weeks afterwards, which actually got really annoying in the end. And then just things like shoelaces, um, you'll see from one of the videos, like they're playing with some bottle tops. Um, I, I did a whole other video because it was just hilarious. Petra had managed to pull off a piece of our toilet and was just chasing that around the living room. Um, so that was quite funny, but that is in a separate video because that's like a, a whole minute of of clip that I wanted to, to do separately. Um, what else? Oh yeah, so so Zavi, our boy, he when he was a kitten, he actually crept into our bedroom and stole a bra strap. Yeah, a removable bra strap from it must have just been out, but you know, like from my underwear, um, and and it just ended up in their cat bed. And every now and then, I just find it in a random place around the house. So. Uh, he really enjoys playing with that for some reason. So I, I've just accepted that that is not mine anymore and I just I just let him get on and play with that now because I don't want that back. There's some strange noises coming from out here. So let's have a look. What? What are they playing with now? Bottle top. Okay, so that's what you want to play with. That's fine. As always, if you've enjoyed this video, please do give us a big thumbs up. Remember to subscribe to the channel and also comment down below. If you've got Maine Coons, then I really want to hear from you. Um, what do your Maine Coons like to play with? I'd really like to get my two some new toys. Um, so I really want to hear any recommendations that you guys might have. Other than that, I will catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.